Hey guys, we just wanted to jump on here this week and give you an update of why we're still at the island when we are supposed to be on the road and we told you by this time we'd be on the road. You probably hear my voice, I've got a bit of a, I don't know, a stuffed, <laughs> stuffed sinuses. Yesterday was really hot, at least for our standards. It was uh, about 35 degrees Celsius with the humidex and uh, that's probably only like high 80s or low 90s so for our Texan friends and everyone in the south you're probably going that's not even hot but it was humid and then we had a big temperature drop overnight and now it's uh, 23 degrees Celsius like 73 72 Fahrenheit which is very pleasant weather but I think the sudden drop in temperature is just something went wrong with my sinuses so sorry about my voice but well as you know last week we tested Worsley out and the engine and the transmission ran beautifully uh, but then when we tried to pop it from four-wheel drive into two we heard a loud bang and that concerned us and so we took it back to the shop and they after a couple of days they got it up on the hoist and determined that the transfer case has some broken parts in it so that's very unfortunate for us that delays us at least another week uh, they get the parts in probably on Tuesday or Wednesday should have them in by Thursday uh, we get dinged another couple thousand dollars uh, it's really unfortunate I'm not sure what was all going on down there but uh, anyway hopefully at that point then we can get back on the road yeah our bags have been packed for <laughs> at least a month now um, so that's all ready to go so hopefully next Thursday if everything goes to plan we will be back on the road and filming for you guys new adventures but in the meantime we got the chance to clean out RV and put that on the market because it's, it has been totally detailed cleaned out everything's fixed that was um, slightly broken yeah. um, so that's seven years of stuff that was in the RV and then offloading it it was pretty crazy kind of going like through a time capsule a little bit it really was. but um, yeah so that's all done and checked off and so now all we need to do is go on an adventure next week so our goal is to sell the motorhome and then take that money and buy uh, another overland vehicle for Carol and I and we want something with uh, that's very capable off-road but also has the comfort of the motorhome we've mm -hmm. often talked if we could take both the Jeep and the motorhome and squish them together into one vehicle that's what we're looking for and we've been looking for quite a few years for something and it also has to fit within our budget of course there's some options that are way out of our budget but uh, so that's the plan and we have our eye on some pretty cool stuff that we want to show you in the next couple of weeks so stay tuned a lot of very exciting things coming a lot of overlanding up ahead and uh, we can't wait to take all of our adventures to you guys and uh, thank you to our patreon family for your continued support and thank you to all of you for uh, supporting our channel by watching our material and liking and subscribing and all that good stuff so we don't have a full adventure video for you this week but uh, we're not going to leave you high and dry to hop over to our son daniel's channel it's dan van stralen on youtube and subscribe and check out his videos he's got a brand new video for you this morning in the meantime we'll, we'll see, see you down, down the road, the road.